Northgate Mall, Saturday the 27th, 4 to 10. Bring the drama. Make it thick. Those words might not mean much to you, but they have Colerain police changing their Saturday night plans. Once that post has been shared, obviously thousands of people see it um, and, and it just gets shared from person to person. Lieutenant Chris Phillips says concerned residents send him this social media post. With the past and with what just happened in Springdale, we're, we are taking it very seriously. Nine police agencies responded to Dave and Buster's in Springdale last Saturday night. We're heading down towards Dave and Buster's. There's no trouble yet, but we're about ready to throw 50 juveniles out. Police say multiple fights broke out and... We got shots fired. Shots fired in front of Ashley Furniture. Shots fired. Shots were fired in the shopping center. A police report says the kids answered a social media post to make a flash mob and close the place down. Four businesses closed early. In December 2019, a large fight broke out in the food court at Northgate Mall. They were fighting the police. Literally putting their hands, punching the police. There was a woman. The cop had a pellet gun, she was getting beat up, and all the men come running down, and then all those kids start jumping on the police officers in there. Police said nearly 200 juveniles were inside the mall. With that recent memory, they aren't taking chances this weekend. Sure, there's a lot better things we could be doing, but it kind of forces our hand to respond, uh, and, and we're prepared. Prepared to keep the peace. If you're coming for the wrong purpose, don't bother. Police say you should expect to see an increased police presence in and around the mall on Saturday evening. And by the way, multiple arrests were made in those fights last weekend in Springdale. Jatara McGee, WLWT News 5.